don't know if you boys have ever felt like this, but every once in a while in video games, you play someone so toxic, so unbelievably infuriating that when it's all said and done and you finally clutch up the W, it's the most surreal feeling you'll ever have. Today's video was initially a pack and play, but the gameplay was so unbelievably good that I gave it a different title and thumbnail. Enjoy this video, cause I know I did. So all Madden, these are the new highest overall cards in the game. We've got Ken Riley, Kurt Warner, Ronnie La, Derek Thomas, John Runyon, Marvin Harrison, and then of course the limiteds, Reggie White, who costs over a million coins right now, and Michael Irvin, who's at 1.2 million coins right now. It's a pretty dope promo. I'm not too excited about all the players in it, but one of my favorites is definitely Ronnie La. Special place in my heart from Madden Mobile. Let's get after it, boys. It's gonna be a good day. Actually, you know it's gonna be a good day. This was on my desk when I walked in today. Look at this. You ready? Just remember how single you are. Just remember how single you are. Just remember how, how few bitches you get, all right? As I drink out of my owl cup, I am homosexual. All right, well, what does All Madden offer us here? Is there a training reroll? There is a training reroll. 82 plus overall All Madden player for 1450 training. I guess I'm gonna start with the All Madden Platinum Pack. We get five 85 pluses and then five 80 plus elite platinum players. Sure. I have yet to see the big animation. The standard animation is this little film reel right here, but I haven't pulled any of the 91s. Kind of geeked up to see what they got. Dude, EA has me so perfectly brainwashed, dude. All I give a shit about is these pack animations. That's crazy. This is what those 90 year old people feel like doing slot machines. Just fucking seen those videos where they're like clawing at it. Oh. That's gonna be me in a couple years of Madden, bro. I'll be clawing at my screen. All 85s in that, definitely mid, but I'm sure there's a set that's available for somebody. Oh, no wonder they're so expensive. This is one of the first bundles I've seen in a while that does not guarantee the 91 overall. This has six all Madden packs, five 85 pluses, and four 88 pluses. Any given all Madden pack, wow. An all Madden pack has a 6% chance as an 88 overall better. That's a lot better than I expected. The 85 plus has an 8% chance at the 88 overall better and the 88 plus wow those are dog shit five percent chance of the 91s i'm no mathematician but there's really i don't know maybe a 20 25 percent chance that in any given bundle you'd get a 91 they're really leaving it up to those sets that makes total sense why those limiteds are so expensive too ronnie lott Derek thomas demarcus lawrence Ryan Jensen, Jalen Thompson, Derek Thomas, Marvin Harrison. I gotta stay vigilant for the pack animation, though. That's not it. That's not it. Ooh, 88 Kurt Warner, though, in the All Madden. I'll take that. 88. Oh, shoot. I'm on 88 pluses already. 88 Ken Riley. Come on. We gotta get at least 191. There's no way. 88 John Runyon. There's definitely a big animation. I'll know instantly. That's not it either. No. Not like this. Not like this. No. Thomas, I still technically have the 85 pluses. If I want to get the 91 and 85 plus, that shit would be bonkers. 85 Derek Thomas. It's another 85 or 88. 85 Ronnie Lott. No. Oh, I'm so sad. John Runyon. And this is not our final player. We're getting there. 85 John Runyon. Dude, I, I never should have opened on the non-pack and play account. What am I thinking? 85 Ken Riley. That was uh, dog water. So I was correct, though. It's relatively easy to get these in the set. If you open that bundle, you need 588. That's exactly what I pulled was 588. But with how expensive these cards... There's no animation? Oh, no way. There's no animation. Shit, so I'm gonna have to really look. Ooh, that changes things. This Derek Thomas. I decided to do the Derek Thomas because I know he's gonna sell for a lot. This is an absolutely disgusting card. Thomas, 90 speed, 90 excel, 92 block shed, 91 power moves what's his hit power 92 hit power this card's fucking bonkers so like i said this is my wheel of mod account so i'm just gonna sell this right now there's also an all madden strategy item this boosts all of your players in the all madden head-to-head -head event only but it's an insane boost block shed power move run block man coverage deep route throw power zone coverage catching trucking that might be what i had to play on the pack and play squad all right we're on the pack and play squad account i know the pack and play squad could use one of these but i'm not sure which player i need the most i guess the game's gonna determine that for us if we pull somebody the game determines it for us but if it's just gonna be me opening a set i'm gonna have to think about this we do need 588 to get a 91 and this guarantees us four so we just gotta find an extra 88 somewhere in here kirk cousins xavier woods runyon Derek thomas 
88 plus, 88 plus, 88 plus. Okay, it's different now, bro. It's different now that I know there's not an animation. I really got to look at this. Like every single one of these could be. Could be. 88 Derek Thomas, come on. You know you want to give me a 91. You know you want to give me a 91. No way. Wow. All 88s, all 82s in the packs. It's all up to the 85 pluses if we're going to clutch up or not. 85 Marvin Harrison. 85 Kurt Warner. No. Dude, don't raw dog me. Don't bend me over and just open me up like this. Dude. I'm getting classic EA raw dogged right now. Ronnie Lott. Mm. That was brutal. Dude, normally I'd run it back, but uh-uh. I am not running this back. Is there a set to get an 88, hopefully? Okay, bet. So you can churn in the 85s for an 88. So you're you're actually in that bundle, you're guaranteed a 91 no matter what. You just got to go the long way around. But if you pull a 91, you're absolutely goaded with the sauce. So I guess that makes sense. All right, so now that we're on the pack and play squad, though, this is an important decision. Our options are Ken Riley, Derek Thomas, Ronnie Lott, Kurt Warner, John Runyon, Marvin Harrison. Something tells me Derek Thomas is the move. Okay, so I'm going to be honest. I like Derek Thomas. Like, Derek Thomas is insane. He would be replacing Khalil Mack. No, our free safety is Malik Hooker. We get Ronnie Lott. Low-key, we could get Ken Riley, too, because Richard Sherman is pretty outdated. But nah, bro, we're going Ronnie Lott and Malik Hooker. <laughs> 91 Ronnie Lott. Oh! I can't fucking wait. Dude, he's such a dog. Come here. Come here, Pookie Bear. Fuck, I hate saying that. Why did I say that, bro? 91 Ronnie Lott. Oh, Madden. Oh, this card is disgusting. Do these guys have weird X factors? Oh, they do. Add training or the 91 ability token to access this player's extra all Madden ability slot. Okay, so do I have a 91 overall ability token? No. Okay. So 3,000 training gives him... So additional abilities, but see, I love this. I'm actually so glad that EA doesn't ruin the game. Last year, what they would do in this slot is every ability is free. And then you have like fucking 22 guys running around with abilities. So it's just, it's just extra abilities, but you still have to pay the same AP for it, which I love. Let's give him Acrobat. Oh, where do we go deep out? No Acrobat. That's probably the most balanced thing for me to do here. Universal coverage, acrobat. He'll hit hard on his own. That's an absolutely absurd upgrade to this team. And honestly, this would be no fun if I just like... Like, if I if I just added Ronnie Lott and called it a day, like, how fun would that be, right? It wouldn't be fun. So let's drop... Ah, yeah, it's pack and play. It's pack and play squad. Ooh, it's pack and play squad. I can't buy anyone. This is a rental. I'm, I'm using him for this video only. And then I'll, and I'll auction him back off. But this was a weird pack and play because of how kind of mid that bundle was. We got Ronnie Lott on defense. We got 91 Michael Irvin on offense. And I'm going to sell him after this game, but he's going to go off today. I'm keeping D-Hop at primary though, because D-Hop has been so good that I'm not going to mess with that. Gonna put 91 limited Michael Irvin where Cooper Cup is. We're rocking an 89 overall team. Let's get it, baby. Also, apparently I'm in the playoffs. I did not know I was in the playoffs. This is the NFC championship with Michael Irvin. Ronnie Lott, baby. Come on. His name is Comeback Guru. I don't like that. That scares me. I'm not going to lie. He's got yikes. Yikes. Yikes, 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 yikes. I thought my Ryan Lot was cool. His Ryan Lot's a 92 somehow. Starting nickel 3-3. Three, three. See what he comes out in. A little run play here. I like that. Oh, Malik Hooker's still getting reps. Malik Hooker's getting TFLs. Hey. Shoot. I'm going to I'm gonna have to call that back. Ooh, it is a true run game team here. My, 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 my. <laughs> Sorry, you guys. There's potential for me to go to the Michigan Ohio State game, which would be sick. That's like. After Thanksgiving, that's what I was talking about there. But um, I got a lurk while I was on the phone in the playoffs. So it doesn't get much better than that. And Michael Irvin is going to start his cooking sesh with four yards. Let's take a big shot. Michael Irvin over the top. We just need this rollout to work. Michael Irvin! That's a horrible ball! What the fuck is that pass? Gino! That was the most pitiful pass attempt... That was actually so unbelievably horrible. I don't think I have my abilities on Ronnie Lott either. 
I don't. I don't have my ability on Ronnie Lott, but I don't think it'll come into play. Second to seven. Let's just get the ball back. That's what we should do. I think he's mad at me for using all that clock there. I'm sorry, man. It wasn't intentional. If it makes you feel any better. Big hit. Oh, and a big fumble. Somebody get it. Nobody has the ball yet. Jerry Jacobs recovers. This is the playoffs. What is going on? That was a risky scramble by Lamar, though. No question. I'm going to send Michael Irvin under. Mm. I can go up high. I can go to the big boy, DK Metcalf. Dude, he keeps running this main coverage. I think Irvin's going to torch him over here. Oh, my God. That's so free. Great catch, Michael Irvin. There's five yards, four for five. Little interception, but you know what they say about Gino, man. You don't write that guy off. They wrote me off. I ain't right back, though. That's the problem. I ain't right back. Let's go. Now write him off. I love that he's usering the grave digger. George Kittle with a nice, really tough catch. Third and three. I'm going back to Michael Irvin on this. Oh, he's there. What a ball, Gino. That's a first. Dude, what? Gino turned into God after all that. It's all just man coverage, man. Just got to bust it. Oh, that's bad. That's so bad. I didn't fucking see Buda Baker. And he shaded outside. What is he doing with his hands? Does that make you run faster? Doing something with his hands there. Well, here's the good news. This guy has two turnovers. We can definitely get this ball back. All right, he's going for two. Does he run it? Get there, Ronnie! Dude, my brand new 91 Ronnie Lott just got shaken off like he was a five foot nine corner. That's crazy. And we've got an onside kick here. Is the onside cook this good that you really sh Wow, this is a new level of cheese that I have never been accustomed to before. That's, uh, that's crazy. Every once in a while this happens, somebody on YouTube finds some crazy exploit to onside kick, and then you see it in head-to-head -head all the time. No wonder this guy's in the playoff. He's already fumbled and thrown a lurk. It's 8-0. I should have just followed that. I think I could have lurked it. See if we can stop the run here. Left or right side? Left or right side? Left side. Buda Baker's in there. That's a good stop. Second and goal. What a frustrating game already, man. Goes to Camara. Third and goal now. There's another lurk from him. It's annoying to have two interceptions and have him fumble, and yet it's eight to zero off of a fucking outside kick. That's crazy. So he's gonna shade outside on Michael Irvin. That was weird. Also not what I wanted to do. I think DK Metcalf's wide open. <laughs> he just dropped a lurk with the grave digger. Third and ten. I don't know, dude. I really can't get anything right now. There's George Kittle wide open. Here we go. All right. Oh. Whoa, block him. Oh. Second and 10. It's literally just the craziest fucking man blitzes, man. I wonder if I could block Kittle and I could get you guys cleared out. Why did you just stop your slant route in the middle of your slant route? Why the fuck did you just sit down in the middle of your slant route? God, I hate when they do that. Third and 21. D-hop. It's going to save the day here. Fourth and inches, though. I might have been able to rack that. We think Adrian Peterson can get this. Oh, just barely. I wonder if D-hop's got it. Nice little drop back. Nice find of DK Metcalf. Is he actually fast enough? Holy shit. That's going to go to the crib. I'm not going for two. I'm taking my points. Maybe I'm the comeback guru today. I got to stay composed, bro. I'm already so pissed off. I'm already so mad. I just got to stay locked in. He has one touchdown and it's a pick six. That's it. That's his only touchdown. First and 10. Handoff. Play action. He's got the right side. Because I can't cover this left well. Lamar takes off for a good amount of yards there. What? What? I'm right on it with Lurk Artist. He doesn't even animate. I knew exactly what he was doing and I ran straight to it. Oh my God. That's so fucking annoying. Oh, that's so fucked up. He doesn't convert the two-point conversion. 7 to 14. He does not elect to onside kick there. That's interesting. Just kicks it out of bounds. I think I can just... I 
can keep going to uh, DK underneath if he doesn't get it. That was zone. Cover too hard. Same thing. <laughs> That's funny to watch. Fourth and ten, dude. He's just sending three, and he's getting absolutely insane pressure. Look at that. He's on a he's double team. He's just flying through it. George Kittle is gonna pick up the first anyway. <laughs> Insanely clutch. What's this? That's more passes to George Kittle. Nice. Second and two. I don't have a lot of time now. So like, I do have 44 seconds. I just got to get in the end zone. Ooh. What? A <laughs> we got a ball game, folks. And I'm glad I went for my PAT earlier because I can tie up the game right now. This game has no business being tied. I should be winning by so much. Oh! Wow. What is that that he's doing with the ball? He keeps doing that every time. Left, right, left, right, left, right. That was crazy. We just got torched. I knew he was throwing it there. I just, I was under it somehow. I don't know, honestly. Oh, we're back to this. I don't think, oh, I can call a timeout. I can prevent that. Probably just go regular kickoff. Now. No, he's onside kicking again. It's just such a weird spot to onside kick because you give me such good field position with 25 seconds. Or is it like, is it that good of an onside kick that it's, it's always worth it? Michael Irvin comes down with it across the 41, 24 seconds. Yeah, I mean, we get out of bounds with the ball. We're chilling. Sit. Oof. Okay, that works. It's not exactly what we want, but it works. I'm going to send Peterson as kind of a spacing route. Yep, and then we can hit Metcalf underneath. Probably just get a field goal out of this. I'm going to take the field goal right now. Make this 17 to 21. This is going to be a really hard game. Butker's going to put it through. Oh, my God. I was wondering why that was such an easy kick. It's limited Butker. That's not the 81 Corley Butker. That's the limited Butker. Just cover four. We're going to play the pass here. I'm not going to guess pass, though, in case he hands us off. Yep, same throw. Calls a timeout on the 50, so he just made it a more manageable shot. He can't field goal from here. That'd be a 67-yarder, and that would be an NFL record. I'll blitz Kalomak here. I would have liked that interception there just for the momentum. For the momentum, that would have been good. 17 to 21. Hell of a ball game. Oh, I do start with ball. Huge. Fuck. And I can't call a timeout now? Why can't I call a timeout on this one? Please catch it. That's so fucked up. He's got two of those now. Congrats, man. It's just how it is, man. They, they find these exploits, and then it goes on YouTube, and you see it in every game until EA patches it. And you know EA is going to take months to patch it. I got to wait, though. On, on these kickoffs, I got to wait so that I actually am selecting the correct play call. Kamara gets a first there. This could be play action. I think after a few runs, like, no, 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 that's a run. For sure. It's good defense. Second and eight. Two onside kicks recovered. Out of three attempted. I did not expect that. Juke, 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 juke. I wanted him to juke into Anthony Walker for a huge hit. He's going to go up. Oh, no, he doesn't. First and 10. I don't really know what I want. So ran this a few times. This is big post route play. And then the underneath out of Camara. Ooh, nice throw. First and goal. Ooh, absolutely blown up by Quinton Williams. Oh, shit. He found that last time, too. Nice play. I am mad that he has two free possessions off of onside kicks. Two free possessions. I literally keep forgetting. Is there anything I can do about it? I guess I can click on and go up and get it. That worked better that time. I can't let the computer do it. Or do I just move them out of the way and let them touch it? This defense wasn't working that great last time I ran it. <laughs> Adrian Peterson, hello! Maybe we get a D-hop deep one right here. It really could be. It could be. Oh, fucking torched him. 
we're flying down to the end zone. You take you take onside kicks out of this game, and this shit is a wrap. D hop. I just need to remember it's about the onside kick. That's it. Oh, uh, I do need to go for this, don't I? I feel like I could go a whip route. Two point conversion, boys. Big two point conversion. Kittle clears, catches in 25 28. Um, I'll go 3 3. I think he's going to run the ball. He probably wants the clock to move. He's ran this a few times. He's ran this stretch left a few times. Oh, here it is again. All over it. No, sir. I'm sticking with Metcalf. Let's go. Third and 11. He's got to give a hot route. He's got to change something, man. Got him! Malik Hooker! First and 10. Now we go score again. George Kittle. Laser beam. <laughs> Outside kick. Oh, if you lose, dude, you're never going to hear the fucking end of this from me. could have thrown that i think i could have thrown that to dk metcalf but it really doesn't matter because i think we can get i we can get this anyway i'm not too worried about it is this man that was just some some man coverage nonsense right there that's how that one was wow that was wild i need a big one out of d hop here wow that's just so fucked up not a single person on a single route was open. I'll tie the game up here, 28 to 28. He, he can't score on offense. Like, legitimately, he can't. So he's if he scores on offense here, which I feel like he's not going to. If he scores on offense here, though, he's going to onside kick, and I have to actually select the onside, 28 to 28. I don't know, though. He's blitzing six every time. I don't know if I can. Is this just the stretch run again, or does he go the other side? Yep, he goes the other side. God, I'm pretty good, you guys. It's like I play this game a lot. What am I talking about? I'm pretty good. It's 28 to 28. I have all these opportunities and I'm not scoring. I'm not shit right now. I'm utter dog shit right now. I, I think he's attempting to chew the clock and beat me, but his run game is not strong enough for that. I don't think. Like chew the clock and kick a field goal. I don't know. I don't believe in his run game to the point where he could do that. He is chewing clock though. That's for sure. He's looking for a check down. Wow, Richard Sherman on Camara, and we don't catch that. That's a we need that catch. That's a huge bummer right there. Let's see if we can get this. Let's go! Broke it up. We got to get in the end zone. We get in the end zone. We win. He is he's free firing up the middle, so actually the edge run should be there, right? Well, not when they fucking do that. Jesus. Free fire up the middle gives him that kind of... That's so annoying. Who's on Adrian Peterson here? D-Hop. Bad angles. Bad angles from him. Third and five. What a ball! The ball of the century from Gino! He calls a timeout. RPO read bubble. Does this work? It's seven yards. Technically, it works. Clock's not really a problem for him on offense. He moves that ball so fast on O. I think I just kind of go for my touchdown here, if I can get it. So he can chew even more clock now. But I really do want the touchdown. Touchdown's very important here. Second and goal. He calls the timeout. This feels so good. It's like a warm spot in my heart right now. I gotta close the game out. We gotta end this. Maintain three timeouts, seven point lead. He's gonna try and chew the clock and score with no time left and then go for two. That's what he's gonna do. Yeah, that's definitely what he's gonna do. Co, he's ran this before. What did he do out of this last time? Oh, the right side's pretty open. So is the left. Yikes. That was all open. Okay, PA double plus. I gotta remember that formation. How do you have that much time? That was a lag right there. That was the shittiest time to lag. First and 10, it's gonna be about a turnover. It's, it's not the clock, it's a turnover. This was a run last time, does he do it again? Yep. We have so many numbers over here, it's not even funny. I was about to say, try and keep him in bounds there though. That would have been nice. And you caught that? In what universe? 
third and three. He's letting the clock go. This is the DK post. Ooh, I broke it up! I didn't pick it, but I broke it up. Fourth and three. Seven seconds left. He has a timeout still. We know what we have to do, boys. We have to win the fucking game. You're dog shit! You're utter dog shit! Let's go! Maybe one more onside kick and you might have it, buddy! Just one more onside and you had it! This is why you watch Pack and Play Squad, by the way. This is why we watch Pack and Play Squad. I'm a grief. I'm a grief with the full timeout, too. Oh, you gotta sit through the timeout, baby girl. Oh, he's gonna quit. Oh, oh, he's gonna quit. <laughs> oh, get fucked. This message was deleted. Oh, am I blocked? Am I blocked? <laughs> oh my god. I'm blocked, I think. I really try not to be this toxic, but come on, man. Come on. You gotta let me have this one. It's the best win of my life. Holy fuck.